Hey there, beautiful people, and welcome to another episode of That's How We Roll, a podcast where I talk with motivating and inspiring women who are professionals, entrepreneurs, organization leaders, artists, role models, mentors, and so much more. I had the opportunity to meet and speak with some incredible, amazing, and talented women for this episode. I attended the New York Now gift show and the Curve New York Winter Show in February of this year. I hope you enjoy this episode and listen to find out more about these incredible women and where you can buy their products. The first interview that you're going to hear is with Alina Sophia Wang. Alina is the CEO and co-founder of ESW Beauty, a clean makeup experience. Alina has created sustainably made beauty products made with non-toxic ingredients, vegan and cruelty-free formulas, which are inspired by foods and beverages. ESW Beauty is a female-founded company with a mission to support other women. Alina's mission is to empower other females to achieve their dreams and prioritize their self-love. I'm here at the New York Now gift show with ESW Beauty founder Alina Sophia Wang. She has this amazing product and thankfully you can get it every place here on the board. So look at this at Whole Foods, at Wegmans, at World Market. And this is her brand. She created this. We're going to talk to Alina to find out exactly what's behind this beauty brand. We are a clean beauty skincare brand. Um, all of our products are vegan, cruelty free, and made of a compostable material. Um, we have two different lines our Raju sheet masks and our plant based milk masks. Okay. And they're all made with different natural fruit and vegetable extracts that you would find in a raw juice or a plant-based milk but we recreate them so that way they are made in a formula great for your skin so the the key ingredient is this can also be a drink i mean not the mask of course <laughs> but it's made like with things that you would find in a smoothie or like a, a green juice they're for all skin types yes so we have nine different masks in our assortment right now and they all focus on different skin benefits for different skin concerns. So you will definitely find something that works for you. I'm gonna get one and I'm gonna try it. This is the watermelon rose, rose water grapefruit. But and that's gonna, called the pink dream. That's called the, oh, the pink <laughs> dream. And the names are really great too. What are some other fun names that you have? Sure, so we have Green Reset, which has kale, spinach, broccoli, and apple extracts. We have Pineapple Bliss, which has pineapple, kiwi, pear, and ginger, deep detox. So you really can get that nice detox for your skin, featuring activated charcoal extracts, lemon juice. Um, and then we have four in our plant-based smoke line. Wow, and it's really good because it's cold here in New York. So these would be really good to hydrate your skin. I'm going to get a couple of the hydrating ones. Thank you so much, Alina, for speaking with me today. And guys, if you're shopping around and you need some really great face masks, go to Whole Foods, Free People, World Market, Anthropology. They have these every place. Thank you so much. Now on to Curve New York. Curve New York is a business to business for buyers and industry influencers to see new collections from over 175 top brands of lingerie, intimates, sleepwear, swimwear, activewear, and accessories. There were representatives from all around the country, but I spoke with three female business owners from the German Pavilion. One of them was Jana. She is the co-founder with her sister of Tiz and Tonic, Emily Rank of Zodiac Studios, and Christina Bavakwa wires of Happy Undies. Tiz and Tonic was founded by two sisters, Yana and Imki, in 2017. They created Tiz and Tonic to get more excited about greener fashion and be inspired to invest in better clothing. Tiz and Tonic was designed to energize you in each new day. I'm here at the Curve Show and I'm sitting with Yana. Her company is Tiz and Tonic. I love the name, Tiz and Tonic. Yana, welcome, and uh, tell us about Tiz and Tonic, please. Yeah, thank you for having me. My name's Yana, and I'm running Tiz and Tonic. It's a bold intimates brand, and we're founded in Bremen, Germany, in the north. But my partner and I, my sister, actually is my partner, and we're from Canada, so it's a bit of an interesting twist on our on our business adventure. <laughs> and this is the first time that you guys been at Curve? This is the first time we've been at Curve. Uh, not the first time in New York. We've come for vacations before, but it's interesting to be so close to home 
and be under the German pavilion. Well, tell us a little bit about Tiz and Tonic and about your apparel. Yeah, should I show you some? Yes, so basically, course. yeah, we wanted to found a sustainable brand, but we wanted the intimates to be very colorful and fun because we've noticed that a lot of the sustainable things on offer were quite sort of neutral. Yeah, so our gig is sort of basics, not boring. And we have like a really stretchy range of organic cotton and micromodal. Well, this looks like it doesn't, the good thing about that is that it looks, it doesn't have a band. Yeah. So it looks really wearable and it won't show through anything that fits snug or that's anything that's smooth. Right, right. And that's part of the idea and that it's super stretchy. So the idea is that it can, fit a range of sizes. So if you're selling online, which is a big focus these days, you don't have to worry so much about returns and stuff because it's quite flexible in the fit. This particular one that we're working with is our is a, with a sustainable elastane, so a biodegradable elastane. So the idea is to have sort of biodegradable undies. That's our long-term plan. Oh, well, nice. Yeah, yeah, because that's a big, that's a big um, topic in Germany right now. Wonderful. Yeah. Do you have any stores here in the in New York area, or are you just completely online? Right now we're completely online, but we're hoping to open up the sort of North American market, and that's sort of why we're here. Tell people where they can find Tiz and Tonic on your website or Instagram or any social media. Yeah, so Instagram's more a channel for like telling everyone what we're up to and where we are and whatever. And then of course we have our online shop at www.tizandtonic.com. What is your Instagram name? Tiz and Tonic. So just at Tiz and Tonic. Okay, yeah. excellent. Yana, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you thank for taking you. the time to talk to me and, this, and your products are beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> Zodiac Studios was founded by Emily Rank. It is a project exploring fashion and contemporary culture based in Berlin. Their collections are curated with a passion for luxury that celebrates the senses and finding strength and vulnerability. So here I'm continuing my conversation at Curve with Emily Rink. The company is Zodiac and she's gonna talk about the products. She's at Curve, this is her first time at Curve and it's, it's another German company here. So tell us a little bit about Zodiac and then show me what you got. Okay, awesome. Yeah, so this is actually really my first time in New York showing my collection here. Well, welcome. Thank you. <laughs> so um, yeah, I launched it two years ago in Paris with a silk underwear collection that is double layered because I was missing this product in the lingerie departments of the stores and we worked two years on just figuring out the fit and the wire because it's comfortable but so good shape i mean you can feel it you just really feel the oh, quality yeah. this is very nice quality mm. it's made in europe and we also simplify the sizing a bit so we go from extra small to extra large in this one which makes it much easier for for people to find their right size because most people don't even know their size. And Is this what you call a demi cup or is that full coverage? This is a demi cup. And so you have matching underwear? We do. This is the thong, the matching thong that is also double layered silk, very luxurious. I mean, the double layered you can really see here at the finish. It's just really top notch. How can people purchase from Zodiac? You have online presence or are you located in stores here? Uh, we're actually opening our first own store now in Berlin, which is super exciting, two weeks. And yeah, it's gonna be like a whole flagship little thing. We have an interior designer that we developed our own furniture with that matches our product. And yeah, here in New York, we are currently looking for partners that we can build our retail structure here. In okay, you hear that guys, if you're at Curve and you know of, uh, you're looking for some really beautiful lingerie, intimate apparel, Zodiac is looking for you. <laughs> That's right, we're looking for you. Yeah, and I mean, there's definitely, our clients are here. I'm, the response I'm getting is amazing, so it's an exciting time. Well, thank you so much, Emily, for spending time talking to me. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Christina Vivacqua Wires is from Happy Undies. Vivacqua is a lifestyle company from Munich where underwear is everything. Happy Undies is a modern, trendy style inspired by colors and a flamboyant mood. It is a sporty and comfortable underwear that can also be worn in water as beachwear. Happy Undies brings a positive and playful vision to people's daily lives. They are committed to promote sustainability for a better world. I'm sitting with Christina Vivacqua Wires. 
She's gonna talk about her line, which is new here at Curve at Javits Center. Hi, Christina, welcome. Hi, Aves, thank you for this opportunity. This is swimwear, right? No, this is a new concept. It's an underwear which you can use also on the water and also to go out night. It's a three-in-one concept. It's something quite new. Um, we uh, are in, from Munich, from Germany. We are uh, on the market. We launched our um, line um, three years ago. Okay. And uh, we called ourselves a happy undies because we have wonderful, powerful colors and also very funny um, prints. And let me show you this one, for example. This is a zebra. We have a collections with animals. We have collections with valentines. We have season for Christmas as well. This is a Bavarian one. Uh, and then we have uh, the Alpen. This one is also with a bretzel from Germany, from Bavaria. And then we have a school line. And uh, this is a beautiful one, print. So we have oh, these are lovely prints. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. We have three kinds of cuts. Uh, we have the high waist and we have the tops as well. So if you like to use it as a, a bikini, it's possible. And this is the idea behind, three-in-one concept. The three-in-one concept. Yes. Right, that's excellent because you have, un you have fashionable underwear, I guess. Mm -hmm. And it really is really nice material and it stretches and holds. Yes. It's good for under the clothes and yeah. out in the water. Yes, yeah, sure. Well, thank you, Christina. Thank yeah. you for sharing this concept with us. Mm -hmm. And can you share your, your website and your Instagram so people can find you? Yes, our website is happy-undies.com and the Instagram is happyundies together underline shop. Okay, fantastic. Well, thank you. Everybody, make sure you check out the undies. You would be surprised. Happy Undies and their tagline is Playful Prints Essential for Land and Sea. I love that. Thank you, Christina. Thank you so much. Okay, you're welcome. Thank you. It was wonderful. I hope you enjoyed this episode and make sure you like, subscribe, and share the podcast. I'd love it if you'd leave a review on Apple, Spotify, or your preferred listening platform and follow me on social media. That's how we roll. That's R-O-L-E for role models and mentors. And if you heard something that sparked your interest, send me a DM. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll talk to you soon. Thank you so much for taking the time to listen, checking out the podcast. Thank you for inviting me into your space. And until next time, I hope you will continue to thrive, grow, and be kind to yourselves and be kind to others.